Alrighty, guys, what's going on, all you beautiful people? It's E, it's the Big E, this is the Misty Mountain Gaming Channel. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back. Hope you guys are doing all right today. It's a Sunday afternoon for me. And, uh, da. We are currently heading to uh, Refuge Point, Rathy Highlands. We logged out in Stranglethorn Vale. I jumped on the bird uh, that episode while I ran up. We logged out at the uh, the hunter's camp, and I ran up to the rebel camp, took the bird to Booty Bay. I uh, did some auction house stuff. I posted some stuff. None of it sold. Uh, let me turn this down just a little bit. Yeah, none of it sold. Uh, but I did clear the bags up a little bit, use the bank there. The bank is completely full. I need another bag. Anyway, the reason we're coming here, I was going to head back to um, the hunter's camp and we were going to continue on, uh, you know, with killing the animals. But we had, we've had this quest a long time. Um, the heck is it? I might have taken it out of the bag. We have a quest to... Uh, kill the thundering to kill the ele elementals in this area there are three different types of them and we're looking for charms we're looking for uh thundering charms crusting charms and some other type of charm i can't believe i took the papers out of the bag i took them out to clear up some space it was just a list but uh, i know what we need so we're a little bit higher level i think we are going to be roughly the same level as these elementals they uh we were having a hell of a time we've tried this twice both times we've just been out of range but we should be okay uh the drop rate is very low i do remember that yeah we are we should be okay here however we're gonna get a uh gonna get a little food buff going i think i made a couple of things up in booty bay cooking wise Made up some omelets. This will give us uh, six stam and six spirit. Spirit's useless to us, but six stam is equivalent to 60 health. I'll take that. Yeah. I might switch over to the sword and the shield to interrupt the casting, but um, we'll see. We'll see how we fare here. They do a little bit of damage. It's not that bad, but uh, we are definitely way better off than we were. I don't have it either. Throw a little bandage on. We're kind of running low on bandages. What do we got up there? Iron deposit? Might go get that. Yeah, this is a level above us. A little rough. Like I said, I might switch over. Now we're getting some pretty good hits. Yeah, it looks like we're okay. I'll just keep with the two-hander. Yeah, so the quest we're doing is a warrior-specific quest. We have two of them. This quest is for Razorfen Kral, I believe. We've got all the other items except for this vial of Phlogiston, and it's some... Um, some elite in there. We've just... Groups are uh, few and far between. So this is what we're currently doing. And I don't know where this goes. But I think it has to do with the Wind Fury Axe. Or whatever that's called. So... Gonna have at it. I wouldn't mind getting the Wind Fury Axe, but if I'm being honest, I don't care about it that much. I've just, I've never done it on a warrior because I've never taken warrior that far. This is farthest I've ever taken a warrior. It's a pretty tough class to play. It's a pretty rough life. <laughs> and no heals. 
Got no, uh, you can't really get around very fast. But uh, it is it is fun to play. Let me go get this. Uh, let me go get this iron deposit real quick. Let our health tick up a little bit. Can we get up here? I tried to go up to the gym today. Like I said, it's a Sunday afternoon for me. I couldn't get in the door. Something's wrong with my little. Uh, they give us a little lot uh, like a little key key fob, and you just scan it on the door. It lets you. I was unable to get in, so uh, I got in, ta uh, in contact with uh, one of the owners, and they're trying to work it out for me. Hopefully, they do because I wouldn't mind getting to, into the gym today. Fortunately, it's not very far. Silver City place where I live is a very small town. It takes me five minutes to get there. I was thinking about riding my bike back up there, but uh, I don't know. <laughs> it's a lot of uphill. It's a lot of this Silver City. Uh, it's a it's a very hilly town. Silver City is about 6,000 feet in elevation in the mountains. Most of New Mexico is elevated. In fact, I'm pretty sure all of it is. But uh, if you go north up to Albuquerque, Albuquerque is in just, it's not quite the center of the state, but that's about 7,000 feet elevation. If you go further up into Santa Fe, it's about 8,000 feet. Still feel like the music's a little bit too loud. It is a little bit too loud. What you guys hear is a little bit louder than what I hear. Oh, we got one. Uh, let's track this quest, though. It won't act actually, there's no sense of tracking it because it doesn't, it won't show up what we need. But, um, boy, I wouldn't, ha I wish I had, we need eight of each. I do remember that. So, can I put these on the bar just, uh, I can. Let me put these on the bar just so I can keep track. I want to put this put it right there just so I can keep track of how many I need so we need three more of these dodge Rooney there very nice yeah, it's a pretty weak drop rate. Not very surprising, though. I don't want two of these things on us, that's for sure. This might be a little bad right here. I have no health pots. I meant to look for some. This is actually really bad. All right, I need to do that. I put hamstring on him. We can see if we can get a bandage off here. Oh my God, this is bad. All right, we're gonna actually just run on away. <laughs> There's a blood elf. She could absolutely wreck us if she wanted to. This might kill us if he gets that off. All right. We got out of harm's way. I went in low health. That was my fault. We are flagged for PvP. And I will PvP if I get a chance. A couple of episodes, two, three episodes, I uh, queued up for Battleground. We never got in. Never even saw the queue time. It just said queue time unavailable. So I don't... I'm assuming that probably means... This server, it's not a high pop server. I don't think it is. It might be. When I joined it, it was a medium, you know, pop server. But it could be uh, it's just not enough people to actually form a battleground. Maybe that's why I'm seeing that message. So I'm not really a PvP PvPer, so it's not that big of a deal to me. But I thought it might be fun for you guys to watch. To watch me get destroyed in battlegrounds. <laughs> 
However, uh, in fu future characters, I will probably roll on a PvP server. The hardcore challenges we do, I'm going to keep in Classic, not on a PvP server. And then everything else will probably just stay here in uh, Burning Crusade on a PvP server. Might be fun. Ba -ba -ba -da -da -da. Let's move this back. I'm taking this off the bar a little bit. Let's put our food back up here. Put it right there. I don't even use Sunder Armor. Yeah. It's quite a bit of rage. And it takes up a it takes up a hit. Uh, it takes it counts as one of our attacks. So it's usually just a little bit too slow. Now if I was in a group like a dungeon group, I think it would come in handy, but actually I'm just going to take it off the bar. Cuz we don't we've used it some. We've used it a little bit, but uh not really since then. I know it's it's a good ability. If you can get five stacks on it, I mean, that is a lot of armor decreased. But like I said, we are usually in a situation where uh, we just need to get the thing down. Going to go through a lot of food right here. Getting our health back up. Yeah, the drop rate on these charms is bad. It's low. Okay, we got one there. We need two more off of these types of elementals. Let me check out, uh, where's my, how much difference is it? It's a lot of strength. So this is our hatchet. Uh, this is our one-hander where I can switch real quick with the hatchet and the shield and we can interrupt spell casting. But I'm trading, trading a little bit of DPS and strength. But it is a lot quicker. I don't think it really matters. We're just gonna we're just gonna hang. We're just gonna keep doing like we're doing here. Might be worth it to switch over on the level thir uh, 39s, though, honestly. Seems like they do a lot less damage when they're melee attacking. Okay. Yeah, today, Sunday, I was supposed to go out to the uh, back to Santa Rita graveyard, and I was going to do my third gravestone cleaning. But... Um, Actually, I had to do a lot of work today. I don't, I, I don't have to work on the weekends, but the way that, because I can work whenever I want, I usually will work on the weekends. If I've not had, uh, you know, I work all through the week. I work almost every day, basically. Even if I have a day off, sometimes I'll work. But I have the luxury of working whenever I want, as long as I get the work done that is assigned to me, or that you know whatever we're working on is uh, our project. So it, that's good and bad. It sounds like it would be awesome. And for the most part, it is. It is. I, uh, I should not complain at all about it. We're going to switch over here. Going to switch over to the, uh, so we can use shield bash here. But yeah, I had some stuff going on this morning. up that and the day just sort of got away from me oh boy are we uh is our skill up here yeah I guess this is okay just do a lot less damage need to check our uh, our skill level as well yeah, I didn't. I didn't play that very well. That was not well, well played. Let me look at uh, what is our. We've got a one-handed axe, one eighty-six, and our two-handed sword is one ninety. So it's not that far behind. We're capped on uh, 
We'll use the axe. We'll keep doing this. I just didn't play that very well. Still need two more. Yeah, so anyway, I... Uh, like I said, my plan was I was going to go up to the gym, and then after the gym, I was going to head up, head out there. But it's a pretty long drive out to the to the graveyard. Um, and I got... Uh, well, if I'm being honest, I was a little disappointed that I couldn't get out there, that I couldn't get into the gym. It really affects me. It does. I've got kind of a problem. It's not a problem. I just... I need to work out every day um, just for my mental health, really. And I, I do get a little bit depressed and upset if I can't work out. I know that might sound ridiculous to a lot of people, but... It's the way it is. So I was a little bit upset. So I just, I was like, yeah, you know what? I don't, I'm not going to go out there this weekend. Now, it doesn't mean I can't go this week. And I, I might do that. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. But it's definitely something that I enjoy that the gravestone cleaning. And I am definitely going to keep doing it. Yeah, this is a lot better. When we're low health and we can interrupt their lightning with a shield bash and it's only got a 12 second cooldown so I can get two off. Can I get this one? I can't do that yet. Yeah, we're a little bit low here. Oh boy. Oh my God, it would help if we could hit. Come on. That ability isn't ready yet. Boy, that was close. Yeah, we missed our execute and then I uh, missed dodge. Uh, we missed heroic strike, execute came up. Uh, and I missed it. <laughs> and then I didn't do dodge right. Uh, still need two more. Oh, I just interrupted myself eating, didn't I? Yes, I did. Okay, not very smart. Uh, let me look. Can't make anything up. Would be nice to get some of this mage weave, but we uh, we need to kill some humanoids, I think. In fact, if we worked on... Uh, if we went back into here... For some of these troll camps, we might get some Mage Weave. So let's throw that up. Interrupt that. Put a bleed on them. Let's get our battle shot up. Not going to be able to interrupt that one. Sorry, right, we'll get the next one. Get that one. Dodged it. Come on, man. Yeah, quests like this where the drop rate is just stupid. I, I, I do get frustrated really easy. I won't hesitate to drop a quest. Uh, this is our third time trying this. Now, granted, the first time we tried this, we didn't spend any time on it. Uh, we did try it a second time, and we killed quite a few of them. But the drop rate is seems to be like one out of ten. We need eight. Uh, we need eight of them. So you do the math there. That kind of stuff, you know, I it's a little bit ridiculous. But I think I'm going to stick with this quest because it's not like just a regular old quest. This is a class specific quest for warrior. And I've never gotten the Whirlwind Axe, and I would like to see uh, what it's all about. I wouldn't mind getting it. I think this one is for the world. Am I right? Is it this one? Yeah, this one just gives us some different armor. I wouldn't mind getting that done still. We just need one thing. I'm wondering if we are... I don't think we could get in there. What I need to do is check the level... The dungeon level for Razorfen Kral. Those are elites, obviously, and it's not like we're going to be dealing with one elite at a time. They're, you know, you're talking three to four, maybe more mobs of elites. So even if we're 20 levels above it, that it could still be a problem. I don't know. I'll have to look at that. We've resisted my charge.
Get a little rage built up. Block that nonsense. Let's keep Rend up. A miss and a dodge. That's brutal. And then another miss. That's three misses on something a uh, level higher than us. We are going to hit level 39. If you guys, I put the bar up here for you guys. Yeah, we're damn close. Handful of kills. Maybe four or five more kills, maybe. Yeah, it is nice being able to shield bash that uh, lightning bolt. Yeah, they don't do anywhere near the damage they do with their casting abilities. <sighs> yeah, this is ridiculous, man. This music is uh, real funky. Da -da -da. We got a ton of cured ham steak, but we're going through it pretty fast. Such is a warrior's life. You got to have a lot of bandages, a lot of food, or a lot of health pots, or all of the above. Yeah, so hopefully they uh it's a husband and wife team who own the who own the gym. And uh come on, can I get a hit here? Be nice if they work that out, because I I do want to go back up to the gym. It's chest day. Oh man, this fucking drop rate. Got my pre-workout dr I'm drinking it and everything in anticipation of working out. So I don't know if you guys know this or not, but um, if you are engaged, you know, if you run up on a caster like I just did here, and... Not enough oh, crap. Missed that. Anyway... If you run up on them and they start to cast, if it's in a tight area like this and you want to pull it back, if you interrupt their cast, they will. you can back out and they will come at you a little bit because they generally will have some kind of CD on their cast. So if you interrupt their casting and then you can run back to pull them away from the danger, they will cast again, but you've, you've got a couple of seconds depending on the mob where you can pull it out of this area. You know, the bad area that you're trying to avoid. Just a little pro tip. So, for instance, like, this is bad. If I ran in here, there's a chance I would aggro all three of these, right? And if I did ranged, if I used the gun, and sh he would just stand here more than likely and cast. And sh there's a possibility to, um, you know, for him to aggro. However, if you've got some kind of ranged interrupt... You could also use that to pull him out. Let's see what happens here. I'm going to try this. He's probably just going to cast. Yes, yeah, so he's casting. If we aggro the other two, we're just out. All right, we got him out a little bit. He's going to stop and cast again, and I'm going to interrupt him if I can. So he shall come at me? Yeah, so he'll come at me till that's off the CD and then I'll cast. Do need to look about look look at uh getting a uh slightly more class specific one hander. I mean the axe we have isn't that bad. But it's not that good either. Not that good. Oh, okay. He's just all over me. A 
little bit rough here. As long as I interrupt that, we should be okay. And as long as we can hit our uh, our melee attacks, that's also very helpful. There we go. There it is. Got another charm. We need one more here. Our food buff is worn off. Let's get that back up. Yes, yeah, so this should be 1879. That's also how you can figure that out. I don't know if you guys know that or not. If you get something, say it's uh, it gives you two stamina and two spirit. Two stamina is equal to 20 health. You just multiply by 10. I don't know if it works the same for the spirit. I don't know if that's also 60 extra spirit. I would assume it is, but I'm not sure. But I know for a fact that's how you figure it out for um, your health. So if you've got something that restores 80 stamina, that's 80 HP. Not a lot, but... Could help you out, you know. You never know. Let's see if I can pull this guy. I need to get closer. He shouldn't be able to get that off. We'll pull him out a little bit. He did get it off. Not ready yet. Good. I dodge that. Won't be able to get that one up. Elemental air. I'm pretty sure that will sell. Let's see if we can get this last charm. But we still have 16 more items to get. So there's three elemental areas here in Arathi Highlands. There's here. There's here. Which I think these ones are rock. And they, they're not casters. But they do have an interrupt. Like a stomp or something. Pretty annoying. And then there's another one over here. And I can't remember what type these are. But we need uh, we need eight charms off of all three types. So let's pull him back some. But like I said, this is I've never done this before, and I know whirlwind axe is a big deal for a warrior. I've never gotten it. I would like to get it. So I don't know how many more parts there are to the quest. I mean, we might not even be close. I, I just do not have any idea. All I know, everything I've ever heard, like people in guilds and stuff, you, it, you, need, um, you need a group to get it done. So we've had this, I think, since level 30. I could be wrong there, but I think we've had it since level 30. So it makes sense that you would need a group to do this part for sure. Now, it would be nice if this was the part you needed the group for and I could do the rest solo, but I don't know. Still need that one more. Hopefully we can get it in the next 10 kills. That would be nice. That seems to be roughly what the drop rate is. I could look it up, but... It's not very high, I know that. All right. Um, let's get our battle shout back up. Kind of low here. Say, I hope execute pops up. There it is. We got it. So that's eight of those. And take that off the bar. So let's go to the uh, the stone freaks. This is probably we'll probably have to spend. Um, like actually, we'll have to call this episode. But we'll probably have to spend. It's probably going to take two episodes at least, right? The next episode for the Stone Freaks, and then the episode after that on the other type of elemental. I can't remember what it is. It's probably fire, 
yeah, it's stone, lightning, and fire kind of makes sense. I'd rather get it done sooner than later. It's still yellow, so we could switch it up. You know, we could take an episode where I try to get the stuff off the stone ones. I could also farm this off camera. This I, I, it can't be very exciting to watch, and I might do that. Um, you know, it's just repetitious. It's not like I'm going to be doing anything fun or. I might do that, or maybe farm it down to where I just need the last couple three. I, I mean, I definitely wouldn't turn in the quest. I wouldn't do that part without you guys being able to see. But um, this farming part, I might do that just to kill some time. I try to do all that boring boring stuff off camera. That's why I do all of my auction house stuff and my banking stuff. I usually don't, I don't show any of that because, I don't know, I just don't think it's very fun to watch. Um, see you soon. Yeah, see you soon. So uh, we hit level 39. That's good. We can't train up, but we can train up next episode. Level 40. This would normally when we would be getting our mount, but uh, not anymore. Anyway, guys, thanks for hanging out with me. I appreciate it. You guys take care, Mr. Mountain and I. will see you guys in the next one. It's been fun. It has been fun. Peace.